into our next guest. Yeah, we thought the perfect person to talk about acts of kindness is our for our friend Sherry Elise, America's joy magnet. So she's joining us now. Good morning. Good morning. So great to be here with you both this morning. Thank you so much. Yeah, we appreciate you swinging by. So talk to us. What do you have planned for Kindness Day? Going and getting a box of free Krispy Kremes they're giving out today. Ooh. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, I like I'm on board that. with that. I know, I know that's not very kind from my side, but it's very kind of them. And receiving acts of kindness actually releases happy chemicals in our own brain so it works on both sides so i'm not just being so selfish today and you can always share one of those donuts too sherry thank you i forgot about that part <laughs> <laughs> can you tell us some other ways to spread that kindness pass it on you know some some good tips and yeah, tricks. yeah i think a lot of people think you have to go above and beyond all the time and that's that's just not the case sometimes the bare minimum is what people want and are looking for uh, that's a not i guess the not not the best way to say it the bare <laughs> give me the bare minimum I get what you're saying, okay. and, and you are absolutely right. It is about simple gestures. We don't have to do these giant grand things, although those are beautiful. But if you've ever had a bad day, just someone who holds the elevator door for you, right, when you feel like it's about to close, I'm like, oh, thank you. Something simple like that. You put it in your poll, sharing a smile. Do you know how many times my day has been uplifted when I was having a, a cruddy day simply because someone smiled at me? So all of these ways not only increase our own happiness, which of course we all know I'm all about the joy, but it also decreases our stress levels. So our cortisol levels go down and life gets expanded. So there's so many different ways to help one another and each other. And like you said, it's not always about the big things. That's fair. Yeah, that's a good point. It's mm -hmm. not always about the big no, things. No, no. Doesn't need to be a grand gesture. Just needs to, showing someone that you care and showing someone that you acknowledge and recognize their acts of kindness, their existence, I think it, it, it it's, makes a world of difference for people. It really yeah. does. Yeah, you know, so right now I'm currently, my father is ill. He got diagnosed with ALS. And so I'm actually caregiving for him right now. And the neighbor up the street came over with three casseroles and said to me, you're probably not getting a lot of opportunity to eat. And that moment, like number one, I bawled, but it was just this simple thing that she did that has completely turned my day and my months around. Wow. Yeah. First of all, I'm so sorry to hear about your dad, and uh, I can't even imagine how hard that is um, yeah. dealing with Thanks. that emotionally and also being a caretaker. We know just how tough that can be. Um, so we'll definitely keep him in our thoughts. Absolutely. And uh, that's a good reminder to you don't know what people are going through. 100%. Everybody has something that is going on behind the scenes. And, well, uh, and who really and truly, though, if you have to have something, having America's Joy Magnet as your caregiver. Yeah. Seriously. I mean, it's like, okay, I guess if we have to. Well, you might ask my dad that differently because I wake him up every morning with, good morning, sunshine. <laughs> and, you know, he's non-communicative right now. So I say, I know you're probably telling me to be quiet, <laughs> but I got your full attention right now. Oh, oh Sherry. Well, know that our thoughts are with you and your family more than happy to do because you, you make sure that people know that it is important to smile on a daily basis, no matter what you're going through, even for a couple of minutes, because it's a game game changer this absolutely a hundred percent and I just want to share that there's this really fun test right now that's online where you can actually find out how kind you really are it's called your KQ and so it's like an IQ except kinder and you can do that at kindness.org and so it's really about like you know, when you think you're a kind person, find out really, and then ways that you can improve that because we really, I honestly believe that kindness can change the world. And so if we all gave that, we would be a whole lot more connected. That sure is would. so neat. We should take that and show we the should. results tomorrow. We should. I, listen, I think that's an ARC segment tomorrow. I think you're right. <laughs> I can do. Sherry Elise, thank you so much for your time. Where can people go to learn more about you, America's Joy Magnet? 
they can go to my website, SherryElise.com, or they can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, all of the things, Sherry Elise. Excellent. Thank Good to you. see you, friend. Thank you very much. Take care. Thank you. Great to see you. Time right now.